Tonight with an update on the funding battle for the Riverbank Zoo and Garden. There was a public comment after Lexington County Council proposed a 60% cut to funding to one of our state's largest attractions. News 19's Jenna Krasina has more from the community on why they think the budget should remain the same for the zoo. It is a plum of our community and it saddens me to think that y'all would consider cutting funding to something as positive as that. Every year, Riverbank Zoo and Garden is given roughly $1.3 million from Lexington County to help with operations. And instead, they are looking at some kind of budget cuts. We do support the zoo, and we feel that the funding is um, proper at this time, and we'll always support the zoo. And right now, we just have to focus on our core functions of government. Chairman Scott Whetstone says he was the one who made the initial proposal for the cut, hoping to have more funds go towards the Public Works Department and emergency services. The initial proposed cut was about 60% giving them $500,000. Now the council voted to raise their funding to $750,000, but the zoo says that is still not enough. It's better than the $500,000, obviously, um, but you know, we came in at the budget workshop um, trying to compromise, um, and we came in with around $980,000, which is about a 25% uh, funding cut. Um, that would be a number that we could work with to sustain operations as is. If the zoo does not get the funding they need, their director of communication, Susan O'Kane, says there would be impacts. But after she heard what community members said about the impacts the zoo had on their lives to council members, she is hopeful it will make a difference. I beg the council tonight, every member sit behind this podium here, to give thought that if you cut the budget to that zoo, you're not hurting that zoo. You're hurting combat veterans just like myself. A retired Marine shared how the zoo helps him with his PTSD, and another shares how the zoo shaped her career path. I did an internship with them, I volunteered them, and now I am a zookeeper. Um, my greatest passion <coughs> is animal care and wildlife. Um, one of the proudest things I am of Riverbank Zoo is how we educate <coughs> our children and our public about saving our planet. Chairman Whetstone says anything could still happen, since nothing is final yet. In Lexington County, Jenna Kurzina, News 19, WLTX. Well, the council has met more, uh, met two times over the next few weeks. Uh, they'll continue to meet to make a final decision, but they approved a motion to give 13 paid holidays for emergency medical services workers and the Lexington County Sheriff's Department.